folks won't be chewing on us. Doing them much good at this point. I don't think we're alone. Someone's yes, we're not alone. That's one way to get that cool one pumping. Okay, lunkheads, listen up. These here are the chores for the month. Only making one of these, so pass it around. And no, I will not be changing my mind again. So stop asking, Braun. Luke, you're in charge of mission, 
Cleaning fish and cooking fish. Just about anything to do with fish. That's your job, okay? Rowan, you're on building and repairs. Like some of the baseboards keep getting loose or torn up. I'm not sure what yet. But fix it. Fraud. You've got brush removal again. Gotta clear our line of sight. Yes. May have to work at night, you big baby. I don't care what you need. I pulled day guard duty again. We'll swap around at night, same as last month. Even you, Braun, don't even start whining. That's it. You don't like it? Tough. This is how we get things done around here. Thank you. 
Hey. Something for you? Cutting carapaces is a dirty job. The pay will be worth it. I got your Meyerler carapaces. Finally, it's done. Everything that can be welded, duct tape, or super glued to the damn docks, all there. Feels like I can finally sit a spell and relax. <sighs> Take this. It's well earned. So, what are you planning next? Been far too long since I've taken to the sea. It calls me, but that's for another day, Mainlander. Fresh shipment. All your medical and food needs. Hey, if I got it. Still someone alive under all that gear? Guns, guns, and more guns. You need some firepower? I'll take a look. Make it fast. Those. 
Bait shop's got everything you need. If you ain't armed, you ain't long for this world. Buy my guns now. Front, dock and back. The bait shop. Guns, ammo, and souvenirs. Get them while they're in stock. Shouldn't take too long to work the carapaces into the harbor. Food. Stim packs. Fully stocked. Protect your loved ones with my fine hand cannons. Avery. I'll be straight with you. It's never easy to ask anyone on this island for help, much less a stranger. But I've got a responsibility to these people, and I have a job for you if you're up for it. Besides, I know you're tougher than you look. What exactly do you need help with? We get our drinking water from a purifier not far outside of town. We had a bad storm not long before you got here, and it must have damaged the fog condensers that protect the road to the purifier. I sent Howard Dunbar out to fix them. He was out there when the Mirelarks hit us, and I'm, I'm afraid they might have got him, too. I was hoping you might go have a look. If the worst happened, maybe you could get those fog condensers back online. If you're up to it, just head south out of town. It's paying work, of course. I wouldn't ask a stranger to stick their neck out on our behalf unless I was willing to pay a fair share for it. All right, I'll head out there now. Good. Our water supply won't last much longer. Don't let the island catch you off guard. Buy my guns. Food. Stim packs. Fully stocked.
So, you rethink helping me take down Winter? like Howard didn't make it. I'll have to repair the fog condensers myself. as you're carrying it. the island catch you off guard by my gun. Those fog condensers are back online.
Good. Our water supply was starting to get low. Wasn't sure how much longer we could hold out. Did you find Howard? He's Meyerlerk food. I should never have let him go out there alone. Well, I said it was paying work. 200 caps should be enough. Thanks. Glad I could help you out. That makes two of us. Now, here's your pay. I've got to start making arrangements for Howard. So I'll say goodbye. Fresh shipment in. All your medical and food needs. And we We live another day. Guns, ammo, and souvenirs. Get them while they're in stock. Bait shop's got everything you need. Got the guns if you got the caps. Show me what you got. You got it. your loved ones with my fine hand cannon. Harbor's safe as it's going to get. You ever get a gnawing in your belly to do something crazy? Reason and sense keep steering you clear? What's on your mind? You're the only mainlander I'd ever tell of this. So hear me out. The Red Death may have heard of it. The big monster lives beneath the waves, only strikes when the fog is thick. People think it's some drunken sailor's tale, but no one goes sailing when there's a fog on. In their bones, they know there's something out there. Is there any evidence the Red Death is real? When I was a little one, I went sailing with my aunt. Fog rolled in thick and fast, and we saw it, glowing red, crimson. An unholy light that stretched to the sky. My aunt was no fool. We rode to shore with all our might. Tide made it hard, but we hit landfall. For whatever it's worth, I believe you. <sighs> Thank you. With my business here done, and knowing someone like yourself, I seek to end this unholy terror. Dozens of boats over the long years been claimed by it. I mean to hunt this Red Death. Are you with me? Count me in. Bring whatever weapons of death and mass destruction you got. Meet by the docks. You take your boat, I'll take mine. This trip is going to test our metal more than anything. Mariner, please. I heard about this expedition of yours. We need you. Please, turn back. I thought you didn't believe, Captain. 
Well, the Mainlander does. And together, we're going to put an end to it. Mainlander, if the Red Death's real, we can't afford to lose you both. Do you really think it's dangerous? Every now and again, some fool goes hunting for the Red Death. Sometimes they come back empty-handed, but more times than not, that's the last they're heard of. The hunt for the Red Death has taken its share of drunks, but it's also taken the lives of our mightiest men and women. Please, don't throw your life away. With all I've seen and faced, this Red Death doesn't scare me. Don't say you haven't been warned. Mariner. I'll meet you there. The Red Death is going down. your boat. Don't tamper with it. The shoals near where we're headed can easily capsize a boat of your size. I'll catch up to you. Much further, Mainlander. When Auntie Stacy told others of her brush with the Red Death, they laughed at her. Then two weeks after, a full fishing boat never came back. From the beach, they saw the glow on the horizon. I've been looking to end the reign of the Red Death's terror my whole life. Wrecks all around it. There. You see it, right? Meet you there, and get prepared. Be that? That's the Red Death? Be that? That's the Red Death? Are you sure this is it? It's got to be the red glowing eyes. I mean, when the fog's thick, that little fella is deadly in his own fashion. The shoals around here are treacherous. A middling captain with a might of curiosity would run aground for certain. And this far from shore? That'll end you. Looks like you achieved your goal. <laughs> there it is. My whole life, I've been having nightmares about a little Myerlurk. <sighs> what do we say to all the folk back home? If we tell them the truth, we'll be a laughing stock. Maybe we embellish a little. Or a lot. Make it the stuff of legends. I have little stomach for it. But it's better than the alternative. Let's go. I thought I got this for you to celebrate. I didn't think it would turn out like this.
wasn't supposed to be like this. wasn't supposed to be like this. Find it. Did you end the scourge of the seas? So, uh, we set sail. It was a terrible fight. So you killed it? Oh yes, we did at best. It was quite the sight. Did you hear? They did it. The Red Death's no more. Did it take long? My grand figured it would take a mini nuke direct to the center of the eye to do it in. That would have worked, but we may do. The seas are ours again. We can fish in peace. Tell me, are you injured, Mariner? Are you okay? No. We managed to get through unscathed. Oh, thank God. I thought for sure you were sailing to your graves. Here's to the heroes. Nothing more to be done for the hall. 